Good evening everybody, it's just gone 7 o'clock on Tuesday the 10th of May. Um, I did record an intro to this video this morning, but for some reason it hasn't come out. A couple of the clips haven't come out, hence the reason I'm sat in a uh, car park over by the Starbucks behind me, Audi next to me. I'm just sat in Bogner waiting for someone to get back to me on Facebook Marketplace because I'm supposed to be picking up a, a hoodie, brand new hoodie with tags, a Goonies hoodie with tags for two quid off of Facebook Marketplace. Um, it was all agreed. They said, yes, I live in Middleton, which is between Bogner and um, Little Hampton. I said, I've just dropped my son at Cadets and I was hoping to pick it up on the way back. Looked for their address on the messages and they haven't actually sent their address. So I've just messaged them and asked them for their address. Hopefully we will um, be able to pick it up on the way back. Um, I'll carry on with the video now that I recorded earlier. And any clips that are missing, I'll have to fill in from where we are now. So carry on with the video. It was absolutely chucking it down this morning. The sky was just a big grey cloud. And now look at it. Grass got cut yesterday, so it's looking good. <laughs> got the coffee table look. The old wedding magazine, I had to go and buy for the wife the other day because it's got, got my stepdaughter on it. Yeah, so just picked these up for free. VHS, Fantasia. Muppets Treasure Island, I like Muppets Treasure Island, so I might not get rid of that. Old Bear, Spots, Busy Year or something, The Tale of Gloucester, Beatrix Potter, Tale of Tom Kitchen, Jemima Puddle Duck, I don't know whether they're worth anything. Can't remember what the other three are, but I'll show you in a minute when I undo them. Uh, pulled out the Clifford James shoes that have gone. Literally went for twenty two ninety five, including postage. Can't remember exactly what I paid, but I think it was... 5.99 and they came with the shoe stretchers so i'll sell them with the shoe stretchers but they're in fantastic condition not much wear at all they've even got the metals on the bottom but i'll um i'll have to have a look and see exactly what they exactly what they cost me i say you know 5.99 i think so Hopefully be under a kilo, but I don't know, they're pretty heavy shoes. Um, you can see how nice and well made they are. I shan't be rushing out to get Clifford James again though, because there's really sort of not enough dosh in them. So yeah, done a little pick up, put my stuff away in a minute. There's my die cutting machine or whatever it's called. That I picked up yesterday for a quid. I've got a Reebok jacket in the Tesco's bag, which I've already showed you. So I'm glad I've done that grass yesterday because it's literally been raining all day. And the last sort of couple of hours, the sun's decided to come out and it's decided to clear up. But it's too wet to go over it again anyway, but it looks all right now. So the next bit of the video was me talking about um, sales. Obviously, it's, sales are picked up in the algorithm and the fact that I hadn't really listed um five the last couple of days uh day before yesterday i had a migraine and yesterday i still had a bit of it and i just didn't feel up to to working uh, here's a mess until it's later on in the day i'm always smart in the morning and then as i go on get more bedraggled um yeah it's just saying that you know um i've packed i've pulled out the shoes to to pack up i pulled them out of the storage bit i had another sale um while i was sat there doing the video earlier uh which was a electronic egg cooker i bought from aldi before and it just sat in the cupboard literally just sat in the cupboard um, no one's used it no one's tried to use it it's brand new in the packet still so we cleaned the cupboards out the other day where we pulled out two Le Creuset lids. So I listed those with buy it nows. I'm not gonna make the same mistake as I made uh, a 
a few videos ago and um yeah so i've put them on i put the egg cooker on uh, there was another couple of bits we cleared out but not worth putting on so we're gonna do them i'm gonna take them to a car boot and uh yeah so i don't know what to do about a car boot this week i'm thinking i might drive up to apps court farm on sunday i'm just trying to think what i've got on i'm not sure um yeah because i'm going to see my nan on thursday she's 96 um and until last year she was all independent and looking after herself getting about you know getting up making drinks and baking me cakes and all that still so it's a bit sad now i haven't seen her for quite a while and um obviously because of covid and then like all the homes have got strict rules and this that and the other so i want to go and see her on thursday tomorrow's the only day that i think i haven't got anything on so yeah so i've listed the uh, most of the vhs apart from two i've listed the vhs and uh, i think i've got six listings out of them so that's good i've still got two vhs not listed that's muppets treasure island and fantasia fantasia is not worth a lot and the Muppets Treasure Island is one of my favourite films, so I'll probably keep that one. If I, I might have another copy of it, I'm not sure. I'll have to check. But yeah, so shoes sold. I've got to pack them up tomorrow. I've pulled out the egg cooker already. So those are the only two bits that I've got to go off tomorrow. Everything else has gone off. Um, I sent some speakers to... Uh, they went to Brighton. I was going to drive them over there because it's only 45 minutes either way, but I didn't in the end. So I did send them, and yeah, I sent them um, next day, so hopefully they'll get there tomorrow. Yeah, so it's been another busy day, so I've just dropped my son at Cadets, I've done dinner, I cooked a nice um, barbecue butterfly chicken, so that was nice, uh, with salad and stuff. So yeah, been busy again, so a bit gutted that my footage from earlier as um it didn't come out or i don't know what's happened to it it just didn't come out um because i think that was probably better than me sitting here in the car park in my car now rambling on so i'll leave it here for a sec see whether i can clip this in somewhere and uh come back to you in a bit so this one was on the bottom i've uh, just scanned it and one has gone for 15 pound plus four pound something postage uh, another one's gone for 12 pounds something so i've just put it on at 14.95 plus shipping so that one's listed so that was one of the ones we couldn't see and then peter rabbit and benjamin bunny there's another one and pingu so i'm gonna scan for them see whether any of them are any good The Tale of Gloucester, Beatrix Potter, and Tom Kitten and Jemima Puddle Duck. So that was a free pick up all those VHS. Okay, so you just saw the VHS that I picked up and I've listed. And um, I've just literally now, this second, at, I don't even know what the time is, at 7.30, um, had a message from the guy about the goonies top so i'm just going to go and pick that up now on the way back and then i've got to come back over here and pick him up for 9 30. so we are filming on thursday we're filming the the second podcast um with a guest as well so we've got a guest on this one so you'll see that on the last saturday of the month but it's going to be a good one it's a good guest and it's our first guest on a podcast so yeah, we're filming that Thursday, Friday, I can't think what I've got Friday, but I'm sure I've got something on Friday. So yeah, it's been, it's been quite busy and I say hopefully I've listed today again, so hopefully it will kick in and more stuff will start selling. I haven't actually looked at offers today, 
but as soon as I get home I'm going to have a look at offers and if there's any I can send out I'm going to send them out because you might as well send them out you know just to move stock don't be stubborn and think oh you know I'm not two quid off or I'm not five percent off it, listen if it's been sat a while knock 20 percent off that's what I'm doing I'm knocking 20 percent off on offers and some people still aren't taking them so you know they're sort of sending offers at sort of they want to pay a quarter of what you've got it on for and stuff like that which there's no way I'd rather take it to a car boot but anyway I'm going to go and pick the hoodie up now I'll show you that when I've picked it up and then we'll probably finish it off so I'm back in the shed picked up the top Goonies never say die Got on that arm as well. Never say die. The Goonies. Proper Goonies one. And it's even got it's even got the tack. Warner Brothers. So there you go. Two quid Facebook Marketplace. I just quickly checked on comps and it said that I just checked on completed and it says that there was a pre owned one went for 14 quid. So I don't know what I knew with tags want to go for, so I haven't actually looked into it properly yet. So for two quid, it's got to be alright, isn't it? So that's the Pingu VHS that I listed at quarter to five today. It's now 8.30 and about eight o'clock it's sold for 6.95 plus 3.95 postage. And that was one of the videos from the free pickup. So I'm already in profit. And that is why I pick up free VHS. Um, if none of the others go, I've sold one for six ninety five, and it was worth it. You know, it's it's where I live. I haven't had to go out of my way, and it's always worth a try. So I'm going to leave this video here. If you like, <coughs> smash the thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, consider subscribing. And if you do subscribe, remember to hit that notification bell so you know whenever I'm uploading or going live, which I do every Saturday. And every last Saturday of the month we're doing a podcast. As I mentioned earlier, we've got a guest on the, the second podcast, which is at the end of this month. And yeah, I hope you enjoy it. Other than that, see you all again soon. See you later. Bye. Night's Life. Subscribe to it. He's a lovely lad. They're a lovely family. It's a lovely life. And he's a lovely man. Subscribe to him.